Judy Rankin, Grant Boone here, watching Brittany Altamari for birdie at the fifth. Yes, I fear that uh, December is that box of chocolate. This is the third shot for Angel Yin, just pulled her second into the bunker. Yeah, she's played that fairly well, wanting it to go. Tough run today at the third and fourth. Yeah, good up and down from the bunker. At the ninth. Jarena Pillar for par. Third hardest hole on the golf course. Good for that for Jarena. There's only been a couple of birdies here today so far. Look at that start that Jarena made three straight to get it to three under early on. Lee six with her second at the ninth. Just 130 yards, dormant Bermuda rough. Look like a little nine iron on a good line. Yeah, nice one. Did, did you see your personalized earmuffs? Only six has this for birdie at the ninth. Pretty flat putt for a rare birdie on any hole out here, actually. Slightly uphill. Yes. First birdie of the day. And gets her back to one over, which is a good score today. Oh, when the tour usually plays uh, this event. This is at the 11th. Megan Kang. And yeah, knocking that one in from off the green. Nicely done. There's a lot of slope on that green. That is a pretty good putt to hold. So she gets to two under par. At the 10th, this is Sophia Popoff. Okay. She'll steal one there at the 10th back to even par. Judy, anything around uh, par is great today, isn't it? For sure. Jong Un Lee, six. And a match pop off. And does in this group of major champions. Lee Six, Popoff, and Stacy Lewis. Well, way more than if it were still growing, yes. It's basically dead right now and almost usually tees the ball up. Never as bad a flyer out of there as you would normally get. That's a good putt. Uh, good putt. Yeah, and yeah. so with this dormant, it would not be. I believe so, yeah. The, this Her home just north of London and in chillier con conditions. Maybe not this cold, but that's obviously helped her. Cheyenne Knight, the defending champion, her second to the night. She said earlier this week, talking about the win. <laughs> what does that even mean? Stacy Lewis on the tee at 11. We talked about this little corner of the green where the hole is located, but it is actually a giant green from front to back, some 50 paces. Trying to fight her way back here after a tough few holes that she's had. A couple of double bogeys on the card. So that moves her back to three over. Yeah, she's got 120. It is downwind. And I still think you have to be aware that going over the back is tough. So land this one a bit short. Had to punch out. Oh, oh, just nearly lipped out for birdie. Nasahata Oka is not a very tall player, and she just has the most compact golf swing. It just, um, it just fit. Nasa for birdie. Open championship at Muirfield, the year that Ernie Els won on that horrific day, which Saturday. I believe, was it the second round? Third round. To 12, world number one, Jin Young Ko. And not a bad spot to chip from, although she is quite below the green surface. Oh my god. Uh, 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 seen that in the Solheim Cup. Would like to see her break through and win. Also trying to break through Brittany Altamare. She is this one breaking a bit to the right, and that was a good part. Okay, so that's more like the Brittany Altamare that we know. Stacy Lewis with her third. I think that 10 mile per hour wind is uh, not quite accurate. They rounded down. 
Yeah. Good shot. Just to get up over 10 miles an hour this afternoon, that's for sure. Yeah, when it was absolutely freezing, oh. I was a spectator. I was in college at the time at Mercer, not far up the road in Macon, Georgia. But Jerry, to Jerry's point, watching Arnold and Gary go toe to toe. Third at the 13th for Altamari. This from 90 yards, it is straight downwind. But that'll give her another great chance there. That was a terrific shot, mm -hmm. you know, getting the, the length right with that downwind factor. Yeah, coming off back to back bogeys. This is to follow it with two birdies in a row. Yeah, well done. Fights her way back under par. And it is a good day if you can finish under par. I mean, that's uh, not surprising when you know who So Yun Yu is. Here's world number one, current number one, Jin Young Ko. Well, took a really nice tight line down the left side. Only had 150 left. Coming back a bit in front of the green. 15. Stacey Lewis was lucky. The chip that she hit past the hole almost went down that slope at the front of the green. But she's going to walk away with a four. Well, Ko's got 113. From the upslope, you can see she was trying to get a little controlled swing there. Oh, most. Pretty good job of it. Yeah. It's one of the best we've seen. Let's see how Cheyenne Knight handles this third at 14. Nice shot. Nice shot. Almost perfectly. Altamari for par at 16. This putt back into the wind, and this would be a seriously good up and down if she was to go in. Oh, remember she caught a mm -hmm. piece of the cup at 14 when she was scrambling. Avoids dropping a shot there. Back with Sophia Popoff at the 17th, her third. Good looking swing. Really good result. Bits come together for her, maybe. She's so unbelievably good. Yeah. Uh, well, could go, could go. Yeah, it was over the green in three, chipped back to there and then chips it in. <laughs> One of those days. Up and down for a round of even par. That's the order of business for Sofia Popoff at 18. Oh, oh that was in. struck oh, so in. well. So well. Uh, the spin, yeah, nice shot. Exactly how we drew it up. 